Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Of course, I am Stories from the Internet, aka Monty. And this video is about Foodie Beauty, specifically her community posts. Now, two hours ago, at the time of this recording, she posted, Hi guys, I am sorry, but I am not feeling well enough to come on camera. I'll see you all tomorrow, Blackheart, period. Now, I'm thinking right away. Uh, she's probably at Natty Daddy's, a.k.a. Natterall, a.k.a. Gonatello. And she just does not want us to know because she's going to get a hell of backlash. Let's take a look at the comments here, folks, because it's completely obvious to me and completely obvious to a lot of people. Taco Bell says, translated, I am at Natter's and I know it will piss people off and I don't feel like dealing with the backlash of my impulsive, hot-headed, angry rants that always make things worse for me and I'm still with him because I love him even though it's all superficial and in my head that we have a relationship so I'm not going to go on camera or go back to the luxury villa to feed the cats because I don't have the patience to fill my tank up again and drive the long road. Pete's and the cats can manage a day. Facts. Co-signed 100%. That's exactly what it's like and we're on to it we know the cycles that she goes through and as we always say it's not over until he is fully done with her and it seems he's not fully done with her because he's having it too good he's having his ass kissed he's having his feed kissed he's having monies in his pocket he's getting a free editor a free videographer somebody to drive him around somebody to pay his bills pay for the groceries and whatnot it's just too good folks jay says laughing out loud thank you for this laughing out loud thank you for this continuation with this arc you owe the canadian revenue agency tens of thousands of dollars in back taxes you have credit card debt payday loans personal debt i need this i need you to keep funding another it's hilarious what if you replies to that Walla Forever says Chantel's first TikTok attempt. Tell us you're running an Egyptian pyramid scheme without actually telling us you're running an Egyptian pyramid scheme. <laughs> Love bug. Back at Netters. Quicker than the clinic can fill your gonorrhea meds. So true. So, so, so very, very true. And, you know, what can I say? It's typical. We already knew this was going to happen. We knew, we know how to read in between the lines, to be honest with you. We already know. That's why I actually, in my community post, stated, gave people options that she's either there already, back there tonight, back there tomorrow, back there by Sunday, end of Sunday night, or back there days before payday. But I already knew that a day or two, at the max and she's back over there probably the same day it's part of her typical cycle next an hour ago at the time of this recording she says so since weird creepos follow me around and take pics of where my car is parked yes i am at nether's but regardless of where i am i am sick really sick huh so she tries to backtrack and retcon telling people lies that she's sick but in some ways she actually is telling the truth to be honest with you because she is sick for getting back with a guy like Natterall. yikes she further continues to say or not feeling well i already said previously that his video was an old one i had already edited true she actually did say that I'm going to spend the day in bed and maybe later this evening I will feel well enough to go bees. Hmm. I actually expect her to be feeling good later on this evening. I can only speculate as to why she is saying she's sick. She couldn't. She could or couldn't be sick, to be honest with you. A lot of people are saying they are D-O-P-E sick because both of them are broke. And they can't pay for shit. Other people are saying other things. That this is all a lie. This is all a scheme to get monies. And to be honest with you, it's working. A lot of people keep paying for super chats. 
And I keep saying, please don't do that because you're reinforcing this behavior, folks. That's exactly what you're doing. You're reinforcing them to keep doing these Q&As, these bullshit content, which is really content, but it's like base content. She's not even trying anymore. They're just sitting there getting monies and screwing around just like how D-O-P-E heads do. Yes, you got it right. Rosie 196, or should I say Rosie 10096 says, You need to sing another rendition of your classic, Pathetic for Us, so fit in. Kayla said, Had a feeling this was all staged. I really hope he never actually hurts you, Chantel, because getting people to believe anything you say from here on out is going to be near impossible, as if it wasn't already so true. But with people still supporting her with the super chats, and her members still here, why would she stop? Exactly. Why is she going to stop when her behavior is being packed up monetarily by all those super chats and super stickers, people? This is what I'm complaining about because it's not good. This is not going to stop if people keep super chatting Daddy Natty, watching Daddy Natty's videos. I think his video is still around 35k, the 5 hour plus one. If people are watching, he's getting paid and he's getting paid a lot. If you want this to stop, you got to stop supporting. Walla Forever says, Nader, and I quote, On my mother, I am done. It's going to take a lot just for her to be able to sit in my kitchen and have a cup of tea. Yikes, caught in 4K. One day later, Chantel spends the entire night and next day, R-O-F-L, as in rolling on the floor laughing. So tell me, Chantel and Tuthi, what exactly did a lot entail and neither has your mother croaked yet from all the times you have sworn on her honor and then turned around and did the opposite? Harsh realities. That's a harsh question for Daddy Nandy, to be honest with you. Because, yeah, he's also one not to be trusted. It seems the money does rule everything. Like, who said that? Cream. Cash rules everything around me. Cream, get the money, dollar, dollar bills, y'all. That's like method, man, right? Well, it seems cash rules everything around Natty Daddy. So it's more like instead of cream, it's like cream. Cash rules everything around Nader. Get it? Okay. CFFCCC says, if this whole saga isn't fake for YouTube, you are deeply unwell individual. Insanity. Hmm. Co-signed. Evil Kitty, the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over again and expecting a different result. Co-signed. Exactly. The definition is doing the exact same things over and over and over again and actually expecting a different result each time you do it. That is one of the definitions of insanity and I will agree with you, Evil Kitty. Casey Jones, I really think you guys can make it this time. Ha ha ha, crying laughing face, OMG. Me thinks not, Casey Jones, but I love the shade that you are putting on this entire thing. Let's continue here. Let's see what else Foodie Beauty has for us. And she is ranting off. Okay, so in between this, she actually did this. She actually did a thing she went off let me put that on the screen folks it's coming up and then she decided to delete it it says right here how is having a hard time ending a relationship scamming people question mark at this point i am just tired of explaining myself call it whatever effing step in the cycle you want but i know my life will just be so much easier if i just stop giving dot a dot f u c k dot what people think about what i am doing in my life people are way too invested that's fine if that's how the game plays out but i am cutting the strings and letting myself live my life and if people think i am a horrible for not wanting to tell you all right away that i am back here so be it stay mad cancel me stalk me continue to bully me unsub cancel sub resub 
I don't give a shit at this point. See, she's throwing in shade there. Talking about, oh yeah, you can unsub, cancel, but you'll sub and resub again. I caught that. She continues. This is YouTube, which means if you come to my channel, you know what you are getting. You know what you are going to get. And I am not going to apologize for decisions I make in my life. I will just try harder to ignore comments or questions I don't want to address, I guess. Okay, anyways, see you soon, XO. Uh, okay, I, I guess. But here's the thing. That's also part of her cycle because she keeps doing that as well. Folks, this is part of the cycle as well. Ranting off, covering it up, screaming at people, doing whatever she wants, then also apologizing for it. So, 35 minutes ago, at the time of this recording, she says this after she deleted that last community post I read. Let me start. Oh, let me start this over. What I meant to say was dot dot dot. I guess she thought she was a little bit mean. I never meant to hurt anyone or deceive anyone by my actions. All that happens every time is that I keep changing my mind about my relationship and how I feel, and when we have fights, I am impulsive and break it off and look to you guys for comfort and support, but always as a means for me to vent. But I am not doing anything in my life for the sole purpose to scam for views, etc. We will talk more later. XO. <laughs> okay, foodie beauty. Let's take a look at the comments, folks, because some people like this. Some people like me reading the comments the real nico says vabs give chantel the gift of abandonment and poverty for christmas as the gift that keeps on giving she and knitter can wallow in it together hmm if only that would happen but the probability of that happened from seeing the cycle ever since it started back in late fall no not what am i saying late fall i mean late spring into summer it's just not gonna end anytime soon i do give it six months though charlie lynn i'm beginning to think nader is almost a saint if you really felt like he was an abuser you would definitely not continuously spill the tea on him every time he upsets you you are not in love with him and you know it you two are just using one another and that is okay if it works for both of you I think he was a true domestic violence type of guy. He would have already knocked your block off. Yikes. But to be fair, that sentiment is felt by a lot of people. A lot of people have actually come to me and said something along those lines that they're not believing that he did some things that she has claimed he did. I won't really speak to that because that type of DV stuff is very sensitive and I just don't want to talk about something I do not know about as in I was not there, I wasn't present when they were fighting, when the DV allegedly happened so I think it's more fair that I watch my words and I don't speak about something that I don't know whether or not it happened or whether or not it did happen, if you know what I mean. Taco Bell says, Chantel, here is some true middle age advice. If you have to keep something a secret, you shouldn't be doing that thing. That is very true, Taco Bell. Thank you for that wisdom. Taco Bell further continues, we are not here to comfort you or your support you. We are not a support group. We are not therapists. We are not your friends. We watch you for entertainment. Exactly. She is not getting it. People are not her online hug box, her online therapist. Taco Bell continues. Why can't you learn that? You also change your mind so often, so fast, and always wind up making the worst possible decision. You've seen, we've seen you talk about things for hours on end and you manage to talk yourself out, off, or into really shitty thinking. This is why you need therapy and also, 
at the same time, therapy will never work because this is normal to you. It's not normal behavior and we want you because you put it out there. Exactly. Seems to me you think that YouTube is everything. Have you considered not going on YouTube or social media at all for an entire month? She would not even make it a day. It's hard for her to stay away from all it is for a day. Taco Bell continues. See how that improves your life? Question mark. No bullshit voices, words on a screen, yelling at you? Question mark. Then again, you can't manage finances either and live paycheck to paycheck even if you make 12k a month. You probably can't afford to take a YouTube break. Exactly. But you can still tell Nader he needs to start from scratch on his own like you and the other YouTubers have and do. You only help him so you have something to base this relationship on. Without YouTube, you have nothing. No boyfriend, no friends, no income. Yet also no one yelling at you when you keep making shitty ass decisions. Exactly. Summed up very nicely. Very succinct. Shen's panty liner says, Getting scared your VIBs are fed up, are you? You are absolutely tanking your channel for a dude that has made it very clear he does not love you. Bravo, Chantel. Hand clap. I'm glad I'll never know what it's like to let a man humiliate and use me like this. Very true, Shens. Very, very true. So the last one. Here we go. Oh, and one more thing. The donation said for CPAP or TV and I will be buying a new TV. Lol. It was $100 and I will take you guys shopping. When I do, XO, stop thinking I'm scamming XO. Right. Sure, Chantel. Okay. We'll we'll stop we'll stop thinking you're scamming. Okay. Who is this? Shro or Shro? Shro, I think. Oh, thanks, VIBs. You guys are purchasing Nether's groceries, windbreakers, a washer and dryer, and now a TV. OMG. Will this be the fourth TV Daddy Nutty has? This man is now TV full because before he was TV less. Get it? Laura B says, there are only two ways that will make this relationship end. Yes, Laura, please tell me. Nader completely cuts her off and changes the locks. Never gonna happen as long as he's got money coming in. True. Or VIBs make an agreement and cancel memberships collectively until then I'm gonna enjoy the drama. Very true, Laura B. Very true. Shannon M. says, I love that people will happily give money to these drug addicts even though there are people out there actually staying and really could use some help. True, Shannon. There's more. There's a lot of people that have merit as to why they would need these donations. But yet, yeah, people are funding or reinforcing a problem that they know is a problem when they super chat. And even though I constantly say this, because I've said this more than once in even this video, please stop reinforcing this behavior. Please, your monies could go elsewhere, a shelter, some place where there's people in actual need rather than these two. All right, so here's what I'm gonna do. I am gonna end it here until maybe part two of this video if she keeps posting to the community tab because she doesn't want to take the heat of actually going on live and getting the feedback of her actions so i'm gonna call it for now if you're new this is your first time second third time listening to me or watching me maybe leave me a like maybe leave me a comment maybe subscribe and turn on your notification bell if you're a regular thank you for always being here and I guess you can also leave me a like and a comment. And I will see you later. Take care.